Hey guys, Andre here. Welcome to another video. And today I'm touring a very special home. It's a full floor penthouse with one of the largest, if not the largest outdoor space in any high rise in Chicago. Without a doubt, this home is for someone with a passion to entertain. Welcome to the Pinnacle at 21 East Huron, Penthouse 4501. This home has three bedrooms, three bathrooms, one half bath, 6,000 square feet of interior living space, and 2,540 square feet of outdoor space, listed for $8.5 million. And a big thank you to listing agent Thomas Chipas for letting me tour his one-of-a-kind listing. To kick off the tour, let's talk about the facade of this gorgeous property. So at street level, this beautiful building is built in detailed ornamentation using limestone, brass, and at the top you have these beautiful green windows. They look absolutely stunning. And then you have elements of uh, granite as well. And then right in the front, you have this beautiful symmetrical entrance and you have these oversized gorgeous sconces. walk up your private elevator you're greeted by this really moody and rich looking foyer and this hand-painted portrait of David Bowie instantly makes you feel like you just walked into a very very exclusive residence on all the foyer walls you have this beautiful mahogany millwork and at the ceiling you have this gold textured wall covering with this custom chandelier that looks stunning. You enter this massive living room through these custom steel French doors. And guys, this room is huge. You have over 50 feet of floor to ceiling windows and it's east facing so you could see the lake. You have the most incredible light coming into the room. This is a really large piece of furniture. It's gotta be at least like 16 or 18 feet long. And it just gives you a good idea of the scale of this living room. I also like the fact that, you know, you're facing east, so you can just kick back on the couch, you can watch some TV, or you can just stare at the lake all day long because these views never get boring. So this area here is really great. It's a sitting room, but it has a very nice cigar lounge vibe about it. Guys, let's talk about the focal wall in this room. This is a wall covering that feels like suede. It looks beautiful. It's done in this very nice shade of navy. Very rich, very elegant. Oversized limestone fireplace, guys. This looks like a fireplace you would find in a mansion, not in a high-rise condo. And this is a real CEO's corner office in the comfort of your own home. Floor-to-ceiling windows on every wall of the office. You could see the lake directly from your desk. And just like in the rest of the home, the finishes here are amazing. Same kind of wall covering. Right over here, you have this really cool exotic wood. And this wood continues onto these built-ins. You have more exotic stone, glass shelving. And again, the office overlooks actually two of the terraces. The large one on the north side, and you have the long one that's east facing. If you notice, this home has very exceptional artwork. In the front, we have David Bowie, Mick Jagger, and then right over here, we have Jimi Hendrix, giving this home a rock star vibe. And speaking of rock stars, guys, check out this bar. I feel like I'm in a luxury hotel rooftop bar. That's exactly how this feels. It's so luxurious, and again, it's in the privacy of your own home. 
So the first thing you notice is this counter in this really exotic stone. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what stone this is, but it looks very expensive. It looks like it could be onyx, I think, mo most likely. And I really appreciate this piece. Notice the millwork and high gloss navy runs all the way around. These glass shelvings are actually suspended. They're not attached. Really thick glass, very well crafted. And these cabinets are actually set up with everything you could possibly need. So you have storage right there. This is actually a dishwasher, which comes in really handy. And in a bar like this, you have to have a nice makeup. I really like this bar counter. It's very nice. It comfortably sits for people. And again, it has lots of storage, everything you could possibly need to entertain. And again, if you love to entertain, you're gonna like this feature a lot. And here we are on the front terrace. And guys, this is one of three large terraces in this home. Imagine waking up every morning, walking out on this terrace and seeing the sun come up. You feel like you're on top of the world. Heck, you feel like you could take on the world. This front terrace spans the entire length of the building. Can you guys believe it? this whole thing is private to the unit? I really love the neo-gothic detailing and the graceful setbacks. The architecture of this building is unbelievable. And this terrace is truly, truly one of a kind. In fact, I don't think I've ever seen a terrace this dramatic and this beautiful. This location is unbelievable. You have historic St. James Cathedral to the east, world famous Magnificent Mile is just two blocks away. The lake is walking distance. You have Ross Street and all the best restaurants Chicago has to offer. Again, walking distance. What a location. In the southeast corner of the home is your formal dining room. And this room is really, really large. In fact, it's so large that you could fit a dinner table right over here and you actually have space for a kitchen table to have breakfast in. Floor to ceiling windows all around, flooding the dining room with lots of natural light. Indonesian rosewood flooring in the entire home. It's a more traditional floor. It looks very beautiful and it works really well with the finishes in this home. And a home like this has to have a wine cellar. This one fits 1,500 bottles of wine. That's right, 1,500. And the very clever feature of this home's floor plan is the fact that it was split up using this unit. And it's paneled with this beautiful mahogany wood panels. And it actually contains your powder room and a large closet. And right off your dining room, you have this magical outdoor terrace. Having something of this size and this high up in the sky is unheard of. You get a fire pit over here with some nice outdoor furniture and this area is so perfect just to kick back and take in these views. You could see to the south, you could see to the east, and you could see to the west. The decking was built using ipe wood and this thing is fire resistant and it's beautiful and it's actually hard as nails. And right over here you have these nice pavers and I really like the contrast between the two types of floors. You could dine outside, you could host people, you could have drinks. Just imagine grilling here, looking out west, watching the sunsets, making dinner for your friends and family and having a blast. This kitchen was designed to reflect the city and the sky and to really sparkle and they have achieved that. If you look at the base cabinets, they're done in this graphite lacquered look. They look beautiful. 
and the wall cabinets are done in a polished stainless steel with glass. They look very chic and very elegant. And if you look at the backsplash, it's done in this very exquisite surface that's actually enclosed in a stainless steel frame. And right over here is a polished stainless steel pantry that goes from the floor all the way to the ceiling. And it's also the perfect place to fix your hair. Six burner wool French, very nice. Quartzite counters in this beautiful light color. They look gorgeous and they use them for backsplash as well. And this is not only backsplash, but it's also a nice storage. Hammered, polished, stainless steel hood. Guys, look at the size of this thing. It's gotta be at least like 90 inches. This thing is massive. And here's your cantilever design island. It looks so gorgeous. Again, it's done in this light colored quartzite. So you have the most amazing southern sunlight coming into the kitchen. This island contains your dishwasher, your freezer, and a fridge. And it also has this really nice hammered apron sink that ties in nicely with the hood. And here's a continuation of your lacquered graphite cabinets. You have some storage at the top. You have a wolf oven, coffee maker, more storage. And then right over here, you have your integrated refrigerator. This kitchen is amazing. It has everything you could possibly need to make a good meal. Uh, functionally, everything is you know, commercial grade, everything looks beautiful, but my favorite part about it is, well, it's this. You know, you're looking south, you have windows all around, you have the most amazing views, and you have the most amazing energy. And you actually want to be productive in this kitchen. And adjacent to the kitchen is this family room. And guys, I'm a really big fan of this room. It has a very warm and cozy feel to it. You just want to kick back on the couch and watch some movies with your friends or family. Really nice sunsets to the west. And right this way, you have these custom built-ins. And these are beautifully done, masterfully crafted. And a gorgeous marble guest fireplace right in the center of the room making a really nice statement. And down this hallway, you have a butler's pantry and the rest of the bedrooms. This room is really good size. It's perfect as a kid's room, a guest room, or even a gym. The ensuite bathroom has a nice vanity with a waterfall edge and a really fun nature-like tile selection. And here's the second ensuite. Great sized room, but what's really special about this room is the balcony. And here we have more amazing views of our beautiful city. Okay, we've now made a full circle and we're back at the foyer with Mr. Bowie here, heading to the primary bedroom. Giant size room. Guys, this is a king size bed with this tufted headboard and this actually antique mirror and you've got these oversized diamonds inside of it. Very, very luxurious. I really like the dark paint color in this room and I appreciate the oversized antique mirrored nightstands. Time to see the walk-in closet. It's one of two, and it's very impressive. Lots of hanging space. You even have a ladder that takes you up if you want to store more clothes. You have custom shelving units for your shoes. Coming off your bedroom, you enter this truly open concept, serene master bathroom. This room is so special. Very light color palette. 
you've got marble everywhere, you've got beautiful tile. Oversized shower, high-end plumbing fixtures, marble on marble on marble. This is actually a marble slab, it's giant. And I like how it contrasts nicely with the walls. Oversized vanity in this nice, more traditional, beautifully crafted wood. You have nice lights attached directly onto the mirror. And here's an oversized makeup counter. That's a dream come true for any girl. I mentioned this primary suite has two walk-in closets. Here's the second one. And here you have a freestanding deep soaking tub with air jets. Looks like something you'd find in a five-star spa. Just imagine taking a bath here, coming out and walking out onto your private terrace. Welcome to your own personal resort in the sky. When you're spending $8 million on a home, you better have your own outdoor putting green. Guys, thanks so much for checking out this video. I'd love to hear what you thought of this property. Leave me a comment. I always love hearing from you guys. And if you love touring beautifully designed homes, penthouses, historic mansions, subscribe to the channel. And with that, I will catch you on the next episode. And right over here is a custom, I don't know, <laughs> it's a custom, it's not a, it's not a bar, it's a, it's a custom wet bar. <laughs> okay, this doesn't work. It's not, it's, it's a dummy handle. <laughs>